again for Burgess. The overlapping run. This is nice from Sydney. Looking to hit on the counter. And Adam Lafondra with the simplest of finishes after an absolutely clinical counter attack. And the home side have drawn first blood. And it's that man Lafondra again. Well, on the Harvey Norman replay, you can just see how beautifully constructed this was from Sydney. Really fluent attack. Ball in near post. Oh, it was a great glancing header from Ryan Grant. And Jack Rodwell couldn't get a decisive touch at the back post. But Gilroy, nicely done. Manages to get the cross in as well. That's a good finish. Almost from Adam Taggart who struck it cleanly on the turn. And his Socceroo teammate, Andrew Redmayne, only did just enough to turn it around the post. Mac, Ball in near post. Oh, and a free header for Joe Lolly. So close to his sixth goal of the season. Major escape this, Perth. Major, major escape. And, and how is there one defender that far out from goal on two Sydney players? Yet really to be stretched at all today. Just that one chance from Taggart on the turn, but it may change now. Taggart looking for space to shoot as well. Didn't seem too interested in the runners around him. And it's out for a goal kick. A well, very good press organised by Perth. Here's Latchman. Good little touch from Taggart for Amini. Here's Zimmerino! Oh, what a way to open your account! At Allianz Stadium, Adam Zimmerino with his first A-League goal. A high five from the coach, Ruben Zankovic. The Perth supporters celebrate. And Perth, basically out of nothing, are back on level terms. As I said at the top of the program, it's all about the timing. It's been all about the timing today as well. That's a good ball from Amini for Taggart. What a touch to bring that ball down and then almost catch out Andrew Redmayne. Oh, John King. Jack Rodwell. On the ball, here's Caceres, who's been playing in a more advanced role on the left in recent weeks. As Lolly's touch finds Lafondra back for Lolly. And five minutes into the second half, Sydney FC with another quick fire exchange in the opposition box have re established their lead. And it's Joe Lolly back amongst the goals. Lovely cutback from Lafondra. A short finish from Joe Lolly. Sydney FC on the front foot with Lolly down to the byline, cross near post, Lafondra. Elsie doing just enough. Well, Lafondra is getting into the groove. Not real high intensity at the moment from Perth. The travel is not easy, we know that as Caceres releases Mac. Burgess arriving on the edge of the area, Mac going it alone. He had options, but he fancied himself. Caceres, who's playing really as a second six alongside Bratton today. A far deeper role than we've seen him in recent weeks, and that's why perhaps Mack into the area. Mack past Latchman at top corner. And having let Perth Glory off the hook just two minutes earlier, Robbie Mack. Emulates his strike partner, Adam Lafondra, by getting his eighth of the season. That's a great ball for Burgess. Lafondra looking for the comeback. Well, they did everything right again, and Perth have to be careful here because they are starting to concede a number of chances. Just Lafondra with the taste of it, great reflexes. 
from Cam Cook. And again, it's taken short, and here's Caceres this time. Caceres driving it across the face of goal, and now they do have number four. And for the second time this season, Brian Grant is on the scoreboard against Perth. And what was a mountain to climb? Well, now they need a miracle.